Hey everybody, Justin here. Welcome back to another mukbang. And for anyone who's new, welcome to my channel and I appreciate you joining me on this meal. But anyways, let's get started on this. I'm hungry and I hope you're hungry too. But today, Jack in the Box and I got my favorite burger from there is the Sourdough Jack. And that's my favorite all time when I go there. So I got that this time. Uh, of course, the curly fries, the cinnamon churros. This is brand new to me and this I'll tell you about this in a bit and of course are the famous tacos right everyone gets those cheap tacos those 50 cent tacos but guess what they weren't 50 cents anymore they were like a dollar each almost 75 each and you know let's just jump right into it all right let's go and I also got the sauces the buttermilk of course and the secret sauce whatever this is um, I've never tried this before, but let's see this baby right here. Yeah. Mmm. Man, that will never get old. Mm. You know, when you go to Jack and Box, you have to get their curly fries. You cannot skip out on their curly fries because, wow. I'm going to try the secret sauce. It even says Shh, secret sauce. my ass. <laughs> Shut on the burger. See what's good. I'm gonna try it by myself actually. Oh. Mmm. That's not bad. It reminds me a lot of the sauce they use and in and out if anyone's tried in and out but anyways yes my favorite and i'm sorry i haven't really posted or i kind of skipped out um i went on vacation on a two-day vacation It wasn't like a crazy vacation, like out of the country vacation. It was more of a go to Vegas vacation. And wow. I've never been more impressed. One of the bad ones. I've never been more impressed from Vegas. I used to go there when I was a kid. And... I used to go there, I went there for my 22nd birthday, and it was fun, but it wasn't like this much fun now. It was like, um, well, my old roommate, she lives there now, and we went to go visit her, and she showed us the best time, let me tell you. Why was it the best? And when I talk about Vegas, I'm not talking about like, you know, the strip going to the, the, where everything is, the casinos. I mean, we went there, yeah, but she lives outside, just outside of Vegas, which is like 10 minutes out. And it was so relaxing. So relaxing. Like it's peaceful to compare where I live right now. Um, she took me to her gym too. And man, let me tell you. That gym is called, um, if anyone's from Vegas and they know what it is. Or if it's wherever it is in the world. It's called um, Lifetime Athletic. And... 
That was the best gym I've ever been to. Seriously. The best. They had so much amenities, man. Like, you could freaking live there. It was a resort gym to me. And you know it's so hot there. They have like an indoor pool. pool. They have like an indoor pool and an outdoor pool. And the outdoor pool reminds me of like like a water park, man. Well, anyways, the gym is not dirty. I'm used to like this ghetto ass gym I go to. Employees are a little lazy. Um, people don't, you know, take care of it, but this gym is just like heaven, tranquil, li tranquility, and that, <laughs> it's so funny, and that going over there is my vacation. <laughs> I'm getting old. No, I'm not. But <laughs> it's so funny because you know people go there to party and stuff, and I'm I'm literally done with partying. Well, I'm not done with it, but I'm just like on occasion. But to go that crazy, mm, but let me tell you that gym just the most. You know, I'm not even like I'm here. I came back home, uh, we had to come back home because uh, we were there for like two days only. And my friend that I went with, he had to go back to work so it was a very fast vacation time and that was uh, And my mind is still over there while my body is over here. It made me so sad to come back here. Not to be honest, up, sorry. It just made me so sad to like that. That was so needed, you know. And I wish I, you know what? I wish if they had that gym. I think it was the gym that got me. They really, literally, have everything there. They have, you know. Uh, it was like, if anyone knows what Equinox is, that's the Equinox in Vegas. But, better. Larger. But it was very expensive, let me tell you that much. But it's worth the price because the living expenses in Vegas is a little cheaper than where I live. And man... Mm. But and she, uh, my friend, she, my old roommate, she wants me to move out there, and I was thinking about it, but we'll see. In the future, you know these tacos. I don't wanna, you know, I'm thinking about it. It's like it made me think more because of that gym. Literally, the gym is life right now, and I know it's sad to say that, but like literally, we stayed there for about six hours because of all the amenities in there. I just, I'm not like. I just have to, sh I just have to tell it to the world that the gym was amazing. And I was supposed to do a mukbang in Vegas while I was there, but I was just too relaxed. And I had to leave early because we were driving over there. I had to leave everything early. I mean, I, I mean. I packed and everything. I 
I just forgot my camera equipment. We left like at 4.30 in the morning. Um, we were too, you know how you're excited and you're just like, oh, you think you packed everything? Not this case. You know what? This needs sauce. Sometimes you need backup for these tacos. And Taco Bell. <laughs> Good looking out, Taco Bell. For the sauces. I forgot to get sauces from there. That's why hot sauces. But, anyways, these tacos. I guess because they're very popular they jacked up the prices but it was a dollar for two tacos now it's like a dollar seventy they ain't even all that I'll definitely go back to Vegas. Man. Just for that. literally spent the whole half a day in in a gym now if I lived there well I would go to that gym just to even escape not even just to work out just to escape because Mm. All right, let's get it on to these churros. Um, I tried these about a month ago, and these are explosive of sweets, man. I, I so hard to explain the sweetness it, and the gooiness of it. <clears throat> let's go. Mm. I need you to take a look at that. See that? My goodness. This right here was as good as Vegas. <laughs> I need more. I love churros, man. And for this mukbang, actually, I was supposed to try um, the new teriyaki bowl, the Jack in the Box, but um, no, that's just, that's just weird. I was going to say disgusting, but I haven't tried it, so I don't know, but that's just weird. Maybe because I'm used to their burgers and tacos only. 
And now they're just like expanding to teriyaki bowls. Who knows? Maybe they're good, but I had to get my favorite because mmm mmm. I wish I could literally just hand this to y'all. Oh my goodness. This is something like I will get all the time as well because mm. delicious. Anyways guys, thank you guys so much for joining me on this meal. I appreciate it so much. And if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And please don't forget to subscribe and turn the notification on for for the next mukbang or and the upcoming mukbangs. And comment section is always open. I'll see you guys later. Take care.